It has been pretty tactical. It's been looking pretty good. I, I just think this one is is so. Do have that real five man roster? So let's see as we get into things. Betway favoring big as well in this best of three and overpass to start off the series smoother. He's going to get met with a lot of tees, jumping around the corner, gets Nico, but immediate trade and optics start to close the distance up. Oh, he's going to hear people. All right. He's going to hear more than that. Tizzy oh. emerging and he'll shut them both down. Quezes, they'll get dropped. And now MSL and Config left up. They've got to try and secure this B site alone. And that is easier said than done. Three players here for big and Tapson not oh. missing a beat. Yeah, not really much success from Optic. No bomb plant, so unlikely going to see a force in the second round. Just sticking to a flat eco. Let Big get off to that 2 -oh. Come it's on, Rush. <laughs> the side of the site, and very, very clear now. Is Optic make a lot of noise? Smooya. Knife out, mate. Might want your gun. He's got an orb to deal with them, but now Optic already on the site. Tess is looking for this kill. Smooya firing off some shots through the smoke. Nico's found Zantara is up on A. Now Smooya's calling for those rotates. Doesn't want to lose to that headshot angle that Tess has taken. Smooya going back in with a flash. There's MSL down. Two kills in, and that's enough for him, but the trades are there. And Config lines up three out of nowhere, and that's the round. Harry, maybe you're right after all. You, I'm right. Oh, it changes oh, I've all lost the time. It is it Hugo TV? Yeah, yeah I think it is. With three O's. Yeah. Very intuitive. You've got to be hitting him up, Comfy, because this is a limited time offer. He'll come to every... ...in rounds like this. Smuya has one. Oh, where's that come from? Tapson? I, I don't even know. I think he was up on the... Uh, yeah. yeah, standing up on the railings. And but he what caught... did he warbang through? I, I reckon it would have been the top of the plywood over yeah. to the left. Ooh. Now they've thrown him up in another boost. Tabson, they're wondering, mate. He's seven foot nine. Just however, oh, still Optic have a chance to take control of this round, especially with kills like that. Nico, he had a phenomenal day yesterday, especially on Vertigo. Can he keep up that competition? Keep an eye on that mini map. Tizian is on one hell of a wrap round. Now he's the man with two oh, flashbangs no. to try and help his teammates out. He has to get to this site quickly, though, because their number's dwindling. Smooya, good for one more. Tess says, for the time being, he's got this one-on-one. -on -one. And Nex not able to buy enough time. Oh. Tizian, now emerging from the bank, won't spot this bomb. And Tess says, very good idea as to where this last man's coming from. But Tizian, too much money. That's a round yeah. win with everyone already sitting on around $3,000. So you're, you're laughing oh, at this come point. on. That's a joke, that first kill. He can't even see him, Harry. There's nothing to shoot. Some great pistol kills coming out for Pig in this round. Optic only with one player in the playground. Tabson's killed Tessas through the wall inside of Connector. That's through the two of them, Tabson. Not getting results from that, but smooth, yep. Alleviating some from down the early man in, that first probe into the bomb site. They're now going in blind. And a rotation from Zintares. He'll join Smuya here, back to back. They try and hold off Whoa. this two, now 2v2. Yeah, that was a very fast peak from Zantares. MSL not ready for the swing, and Smuya has dropped on five. 20 seconds. He could get this kill and open up B. He's got to be able to. Tizian keeping the round in the favor, considering neither team here has picked up a victory just yet. This is. Uh, all the more important as to not get relegated. Oh, look to stick to. Oh, aggressive peak, but the flash comes right before Config takes the fight. Tizian trying to go back in for more, and Nico will trade him after just one. Not going to be able to get next off the barrels, though, who doubles up. Any more from him? No. MSL with a trade. Galil proving to be prosperous for, here for Optic. That molly should cut off the rotate. Great nade from Zantares puts MSL low. Another molly. Tick, that bomb's almost done. They need to stick it. Smoke for the defuse. Smooth's just got to get right on it and hope Zantares can defend him. There's the tap. Now he's off it, trying to get the kill, but this bomb is going to go right off. And Tess is killing Zantares has signaled the end of the round. Smooth might even die to the bomb here. Oh, in there. And Optic pick up the round. Boost at the back of the bomb site. Next is the man throwing up in it. Now he misses that first shot. And yeah, that boost becomes a bit of a death sentence once they know you're there. So he's got to get down. And these rotations getting cut away by Nico. This round, it should already be over unless some kills can come through soon. Next, getting that one, maybe that spurs big on to go for this. Through Monster, you know, jiggled and baited out a shot. And from then on, like you said, I think it was Tizzy needed to drop off that boost. You can't commit to that. You can't stay. And with that boost being de deconstructed, 
Oh, nice angle though. MSL attempts the fight, will get some damage off, but Xantaris wins it. Tabson's blind, but they haven't checked the tree, and he's fully covered here. Config, quick flick, gets the return, and Xantaris has been dropped in the play, gets delayed. This could all fall apart oh, next. No. He's been spotted, the flashbang holds back the long peak, but Nico, such an important kill. Smoothia tries to deny the bomb plant, and it's into the moors of Config. Blow it down the steps into the arms of Tizia. Nice big brain Config. <laughs> It through with just seconds remaining. I mean, stars aligning from Optic. Oh, what a peak! That is savage stuff from Config, uh, and he really is on a tear. Quez, uh, for big maybe on B short, but that really doesn't matter. Next, his position is null and void. All he can do is cut off a rotate from Tessa's T side so far. Ooh. Oh, no. I mean, that gun getting stripped away. Now you're in an awkward spot, right? You could have had two rifles dropped over. You would have had a buy in this round, and now that's just not the case. You've only got the AWP on Smoothia. I imagine with how big I've been playing, with what we've seen as... Nice. Faster start from Smoothia. He immediately puts that AWP to good use. They put him down in the connector. For that sole reason to try and snatch a man advantage away from Optics. And Tarez has helped out. Was 3v5, matter of seconds into the round. They just go completely back to the drawing board, right? They were set up over the wall. Maybe going to try and flush Centares out. Oh, oh, that's just so clean. Bomb tumbling config. Well, this would be a clutch for the age. He's got to get ahead of that Molly. He will. Zantaras is dead. But he can't escape back up to A. That Molly separates him from the top site. Tries to get Smear through the wall. And he takes Tizian down. Door swung open. And Smear shuts the round. 8 5. Big still salvaged that one. But config certainly made that look interesting, at least for a moment. Not only getting the Deegan connector here, but also following up with two more AK kills. Really makes that round work for Big. I'm getting a lot of, uh, you know, like memories and absent and Zantares back into A, but it's too little too late because already Optic are here. Really heads up play from Optic, but will Tabson be able to stop it? In the madness, Nico getting aggressive for another kill, and that's the rotate gone. Tizian can get a kill down on B, but uh, has been made. The rest of Optic running towards playground as well, but it seems like both these players will get away with their guns. And Optic, oh no, that's... Uh, killer that makes a lot of difference because the buy right he has but next up boosted on b getting caught moving out and they line up so much damage he does almost 300 damage in this round but he only gets one kill for it Zantares dropping nico back in t-spawn that molly should be able to lock tizian in place but he can run a gun with the smg msl doesn't let him escape scoped up on heaven where smuya sits with the orb smokes eluding his vision too Trying to flash Zantaras back into the site. This bomb yet to go down here for Optic. Zantaras doing everything he can to refrain that from happening. That Molly, though, goes out in the smoke, and the bomb plant does come through for Optic. Ah, oh, 12 points of health on Config as he's desperately looking for a means of finding something before he goes down. Not the case. It's MSL and Quez left in this one. Now just MSL. He has been struggling. We haven't seen the AWP from him this map, but he's looking to make a return. Oh. And he's almost in with four. He's tagged up Smuya, and he'll <laughs> find him through the smoke. Oh, MSL, that's the man that we've missed. Fist bumps all around. There's a, always a chance, but... Not the case. He calls for a rotate. MSL moves up and big move down through the connector. Just trying to gain some more map control, clear out. Haven't adjusted from this three man setup. Quez, he's going to get flashed off. Oh, Config saves his life, luckily enough. Both players blind, jiggling on the pillar. Config gets picked up. These blocks up close and next with two kills. But Nico still here. They haven't cleared him. But uh, here's where the game really starts up once again in the second half. Up to coming in with a buy. For example, five players grouped up over towards toilets are big. Slow creep forward. That shadow gives oh, away no. not just the position of Tizian, but with his death, the bomb dropped out in the open as well. It's quickly remedied thanks to Nex and Tabson. They're able to get control of this situation once again. And now the A site just overrun with big players. If you're Optic, and so that I really thought with Tessa's opening things up, getting that site. Big able to creep all the way up on the toilet. The round's over because those CTs on B are too far away to have any impact in. Over 
so a lot of this round now for Optic hinges on uh, not just this first oh, fight no. that MSL is taking now, but Tessa's in connector, oh, no. and he's not able to win his fight. That's what I was looking for. What? Zantara's on that flank down through mid. The idea there is that MSL and Tessa's have that connector control so that once MSL takes a shot, he can dart down connector. Him and, uh, and Tessa's could have then looked to exit. But hang on a moment. They flipped this round back on its head. It's the heroics of Nico. And maybe, oh, comp, oh no, Tizzy in four by three to death. Back in, not to be, however, an optic. They finally break the streak. They'll get their first rifle round on the board. Tessis has got to be so happy his team picked up the pieces there. The fact that Zantarids is able to get an angle onto MSL without Tessis covering him is, you know, I hate to use the the long toilets he might be about to get one hell of a reward next is drawing the attention oh. away and they'll catch msl now at the rock there's still a man tess is actually on his bike he's got to pedal himself out of this situation and instead he'll get snuffed out nico quez all that's left And you know Big Wanna Hunt as well. They know these are the B players, they know where they are, and they are on the hunt. Santares with a kill, and Nico gets one, but now they know exactly where to check. And I love that angle from Santares. Jumps on the barrel, you know, shoots, through the, shoots through the wall. Hard kill to find for Nico, and that's Big taking another round. I always liked spots two players as well and look at the rotate look at the move from optic they send players back up towards a but that doesn't account for they don't account for the luck tizian was always out monster the whole time catching nico config has re-aggressed but tizian is ready for it another frag and to think the bomb is still on a right now he is drawing so many rotations so much attacker but this almost becomes harder to lose than it does to win tess Ooh. says he's got to step up and only one kill. This is where that flag from MSL needs to come into his own. It's that rap from Tizzy. And oh, MSL, he's got his head on a swivel. This man's part owl. And now he's looking around in bottom mid, trying to find even more. There's 10 seconds as that bomb tries to get into the site. No. Quez getting rid of next. And it's Smuya left alone. He's got to deal with Quez first. And he can't. He's not challenging with shots like that being landed by a bit slow on the AWP for the first two days. Well, uh, not so much anymore. I, yeah, I'm shocked. I don't know how big lose that round. I mean, that's ridiculous from MSL. A bit of a whiff from Tizian on that long flank, but he did his diligent, uh, due diligence down on B. MSL seems to accompany Tessas constantly. You know, both of them trying to play off each other. And that's a great check from Tabson. Showing the bomb, most importantly. I wonder how that will adjust these rotations. Config is coming up towards A. So Tabson was just late to join them. I wonder if they commit here. Tabson's got another A pick. They may as well go back up towards the top side, but they're running into the stack down on B. Optic have yet to rotate. Nico getting one. Quest dropped in the meantime. And now Big realize, okay, there's another player on this site. Let's just commit towards A. Zantares gets the B pick. And everywhere Big go, Optic are waiting. But it might not matter. The trade is in with us with the rotations too well like they, they they end up trying to pick onto long boosted up by his teammate that's a helpful start here for optic man advantage and three on this a site as the t start to close the distance smooth is ready not blinded by the flashbang taking down msl and Zantaras. he's waiting he's waiting for no one he's already up on truck they don't realize he's wrapped the backside tessas is here though are big aware of the long position they have no one here to stop him they saw msl boosted so they might believe that config was the second man inside of the site now bodies are still falling for optic tessas your yeah, time to shine is now bomb drop tabson oh. found but he's not able to dethrone Zentares. Quez, 1v3, the lone oh B-bomb site boy, asked to step up, and he's on 14 points of health, so he's got to leave. He's got to bow out of this round. He ducks and weaves in through CT. That M4 is going to be the bulk. I don't know, man. Zentares, he, he smells the blood. He can smell it in the water, but... Uh... Certainly not a fish. I mean, sharks are fishes, but let's not, let's not get into that. Yeah. Um... <laughs> You're making it sound it's like a common debate. Them from overtime. Even then, the battle just starts. That's a great start, though. Quez getting a kill down on B. Tizian has been a nuisance, and he... All big. All four players here, and they're just going in dry. They're not Ooh. signaling anything with utilities, and Tarez gets that trade. It's Tessez's close position. <gasps> oh, oh no. Smuya! 
here. Very what? lucky in Zentares. No luck for this one. It's just skill pivoting around, shutting this round out. And it's Optic, two versus three. Suddenly, this has been stripped away from them. It was feeling comfortable. And now it's any thought. Everyone here for big and no one is budging an inch. That shot from Smuya misses, but it doesn't the second time around. Quez, there is no way he can win this out with that many players in toilets. It's over. And that is going to be the game going, or the map rather, going the way of big. Smuya needs to give Zantara's a big kiss on the forehead there, saving his life with three kills and then the... Along those yeah, lines. you should, because you're sitting and here topless and frankly yeah. having enough of it. You know, wear some clothes, Harry. I'm so sorry, but Disgusting it's hot man. in this room, and it's, it's not, about it's to get even. At this point in time, the wonderful folks at Betway could have this one looking, uh, looking right, at least in the odds. And Nico, Ooh, well, not. maybe not, maybe not, as him and Tess says, making quick work of this B play. It's already shut down, and Zantara uh, is... Yeah. Missing those shots, Tizian alone, one on three, and it's the app strap that should to it. No, 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 should to by the by the paired nor ready oh, no. for MSL has just missed the oh, tab tabs and all right shutting down MSL. I thought MSL was at least going to get that one kill. Just chaos. And now over here at ramp, Quez with his MP9 churns up next into a thick, buttery paste, and Tabson desperately trying to get this trade, but Quez, he's elusive. He's just darting around, dodging these shots. Tizian on the wrap in through CT. That should be the man that solidifies this round. He'll find Tessez, and with that kill, it there are times to be a hero, and this is not one of them. Tizian nades in control for free there early. Even though MSL has the orb, they're not scared at all. And even in the three on one, where they know that Quez is down on ramp, all three of them uh, come towards A. They're just like, yeah, we, we just want this kill. Let's just the game and and they're just giving all this time for optic once they get a man advantage they give optic so much time to kind of doubt themselves and and play into these rotations it's a slaughter harry yeah i cut myself short on that one because i thought round now for big on the board and it smiles all around that i think may regret not throwing out that grenade because there's so many players moving through he will eventually but they're already out the window Tizian dropping into the site config with a crossfire but he can't catch tabs and moving up the catwalk the player at the back of the site is not long for this it's an open default plant for apartments what can you even do here for your optic if not save one exit but uh, there's still a player in the site Santares, oh, he's running for it, and he's dead. So no exits here for Big. Excited by this team, despite them not picking up a win yet, is just because of this call. They've got an aggressive in the apartments. MSL's pushed all the way through, and therefore Optic know this is an A play. But knowing Harry, well, that's half the battle. The battle is the other half of the battle, and they're gonna have to try and win it with pistols here. This flank, though, very fast. MSL has some real speed to him. Quez, great shot, Config following up with two Ds out of nowhere. The trade is in, but MSL finally striking from behind. And Tizian, there's no way he's getting out of this one alive. It, well, they really do make all the difference. I see these Ds. Oh, ah. Oh. The uh, song from the Nightman Cometh. Ooh, ah. <laughs> Little boy, Hugo, baby you, boy. You are the Dennis Reynolds of esports. Please don't say that. Yeah, actually, I don't know. Got Tizian in the apartments and Tara's creeping up through Ooh. short. That orb's presence might now be enough for them to reconsider. Oh, Tabson what? caught off guard and MSL is very, very fast there to find that kill. It's a huge one for them to grab. Smooth has even been dinked up and Optic, things are looking good for them to find a fourth round here. Yeah, it's window now Smuya is on the flank, but MSL getting caught this time finally dead. Tessez swivels and takes the kill. That will keep this round alive for Optic and if anything in the favor despite his low HP and Tizian's gone. That's a fantastic round for Optic. Back to back going. MSL, the foresight to check behind but not just the foresight, the ability to hit that shot is ridiculous. Let's see this next kill. Just oof. Even though they have the double flank, it's not enough. Great round for Optic seen uh, that attempted since I think it was like round four or round five, something along those lines. Obviously, the flow of the game and reading the rotations well, it feels like maybe they're out braining themselves sometimes. Whoa. MSL, big brain. 
for an even bigger play. However, utility, getting that smoke down gives them an avenue. Yeah, nice kill from Next, though. Zantares watching the smoke, and Nico crawls to his death. Flash forward CT should keep that one play do anything, but Config, all he needs to do is keep coming in on this flank. Tessis has him at least attracted towards his position, and now Config is here to strike. First kill, no trade allowed, and Config dropped around. So, working out wonderfully right now. Eight to four. MSL just keeping it up with these AWP kills in the apartments. His rotates have been very, very good, continually shifting between B and window. Everywhere big window, and there's limited utility here for big, so likely not going to dedicate a smoke for the window, but where has that come from? Double entry in middle, the flashbangs are good, everyone was blind. To execute into this A site, Quez. Lot to do, and so many players just closing in around him like some sort of. Allow us for the open. Get away with a fifth round, a long time coming. Long, a long overdue, rather. Optics still have money thanks to that save. Those two guns being dragged forward to another round. They can buy around them. Perfect mid picks that round for big as well. To what was going on behind him. And those footsteps happen immediately. He's back. These players under Palace should be able to hear that. He's gone through this defensive CT smoke as well. And that allows for the trade onto Zantares. Not the second time around. This is where we need to see that double setup yield some results. Nico Ooh. out in the open, flushed out. By the players just running into his smoke. Eight seconds, his bomb's gonna go down. Just a few to spare, and that will be the round for big. Yeah, that wasn't is that you know you get split from ramp and palace, and Nico gets the job done. But the reason that didn't work is Quez dies from the connector split. I think it was from uh not Smooya, whoever it was, he dies from the connector split, and then Hulk, so it was given away. It's just unfortunate, just because big split middle and next will not let Tessis get away. And Big have really put themselves in a great situation to get this 7-8 half. Set themselves up nicely for a third in a row. Nades and Smoke into top mid. They try and set Nico up here. Flashbangs to try and thwart this, but first one misses or Nico dodges it. And that allows him to get a kill. And the problem is these players, they wanted to go through and try and trade, but you've already lost two. They know they can't afford to throw any more bodies at this oh. problem. No matter how many they seem to, it's just not going away. In Big are going to have their work cut out for them, uh, especially in this round. Tizian, a one on five, lower mid player spotted, but the spray transfer is not. He's over at ramp, throwing all of it out into this A site, trying to sell what I would imagine is this fake. Three players up in the apartment. They're not heading in towards lower tunnel, so this is the B play. And Big, oh. they'd almost fallen for this hook, line, and sinker. Next, hitting that shot into the apartment, so is kind of giving away the ruse, the the mystery that Optic were going for. Yeah, it's a couple of seconds separating uh, Optic with a very good chance of winning this round. Now it's going to be a hard one. MSL, one tap. Zantaras is not stopping with this P2K. Nico catching Tizzy and moving through the market. And there's still a player there. These two Ts exposed to the doors. And Tessa's great shot to next, but is it going to be enough? That bomb is not planted for him, and they're already sticking to defuse. No kit here for Big. No worry, you would think. And come back in. Big start the half off with the pistol. The road to recovery here. The road to that 2 0. They don't want to so they'll need to win this map. Santara is continuing to be a beast in the pistol rounds as he always is for big. Much money, arguably. Off on MSL and already that man advantage taken. You've dropped Smooya. You know their money low. You've dealt with the man who oh. usually dons it. And this round... Waiting for it. This could be huge. Config's low. Oh, the timing. He turns around as Config enters the... Heard by Tabson, but just a second too soon. Hunting, looking for those saving players. He gets them both. This is an interesting one from Smooya. Just waiting in mid. He's, he's almost tempting them Ooh. to go for it. And it gets lucky. A bit worrying maybe for Big as this push looks to come in. Ramp, not the ideal yeah. place to defend this A site from. And now that they're up through connectors and Tara just gets oh. blindsided. But Tabson, he might have just saved this round. He drops the bomb and now precious time being wasted. Next, dropping it again. And this bomb is getting juggled around. It's a hot potato and it's too hot. And Tabson and Next 
doing a lot there to save that one because it looked like it was about for what Optic were throwing at them. Tabson was supposed to stop those players from crossing. He couldn't because he gets smoked off. But a hero play through the smoke, not covered by connector. And up mid, unless Smooya gets aggressive. So that is done. Smooya does have deep mid control. That smoke landing behind him. He can back up into it after he hits a shot. Bomb dropped. MSL out of the round. And Smooya can just retreat. Tabson's made the cat jump in the meantime, but he is getting wrapped from under. Needs to be aware of that. Config in position. Tess is getting... You know what? There we go. Nico just walking into frame. Smooya. Oh, baby. Might have to do more still over at B, actually. Ooh, this is a change-up. Tessas takes the bomb into what? window, and that is such an important kill that it goes the way of Optic with it. The A site is now open for business. Bomb, trap round from Tizzy, and who gets the job on who? Config spotted, but actually coming off better in that fight. Even dropping the Molotov just keeps Tizzy... TikTok. Not yielding anything, and now with Config getting another. This leaves Tessas up in the palace. They've cleared ramp. They've got to get on this bomb. They tap it, and no they kit. do find Tessas. Tizian's got the kit. It's down to the wire. No. Oh, and it's no. not going through. Optic get a 13th round. As you said, that would have been the round lost. And, you know, the fact that Config's able to even get out of ramp after Tizian shows his face there. That was a whirlwind of a round, and... With only one kit, that being on Tizzy and the man who was trapped by Ramp. Though, 14 to 10. They couldn't do it back on Overpass, but they might be able to here on oh. Big's map pick of Mirage. The much as three players. Oh, oh, the little entourage there arriving into the ladder room next. This isn't even a rock at a hard place. This is just a hard place at a hard place. He's just between two hard places. And now Smooya and Tizian, two versus four. It's got to be a safe... All the players surviving as well. Four alive at the end of it. Auto shotgun and a dream. A dream of keeping this game going. Holding close. They do check for him, but the auto shotgun, good for one. Little bit more chip damage. Tabson standing oh. in that Molotov. Burns to his death. Smoothie on the rotation, first man in, and he's not showing any signs of fear. I guess he's got nothing to lose. Oh. Will swing wide and remove Nico. MSL missing the follow-up shot. That should have been the trade, but it's not. He will get Zentorez. Oh, Smoothie making something of this round. MSL tagged down low, six points of health to try and get Optic the win. Smoothie and Smoothie still to find even more damage done and justifiable fist bump there for that man. But that's only the start, Harry. Four more rounds needed even to hit overtime. Valiant effort from Smuya, but that's Optic just going for a set B play at the beginning of the round. That's that's nothing that they've run all T-side long to move through middle. Connect is going to be taken as well. Comfy's coming from lower. That's a kill. Smuya finishing off the job that Zantara started, and he'll finish another job. MSL. Quez even spotted up in Palace and Zantara's peeking from the stairs, just making quick work of him. Big playing off of one of each other. Or what happened? Nico alone and fed to the wolves. Flash goes in, won't blind him. Santarez getting the kill anyway. Big 12 to 15. They needed five in a row. Oh, that was just, yeah, trying to throw a smoke, getting spammed through the corner. Godless, great round from Santarez again. Coming in with a couple of crucial longer optic they are not wasting any time they're setting up for the a default here all these smokes raining in and it is just Whoa. the a push great opener from tessas the hero of last round his actions long forgotten we Whoa. need a new hero and zentares smooya they might be it msl and nico they've got to try and rescue this one from the clutches of defeat two versus four to try deny overtime and wherever they turn they're getting shut down nico what can he offer? What can he bring to the table? One point of health, and Edares goes down. He's not even peeking. He's not giving anything away. And this should be it. This should be the round dead to right. Zantares yeah. gets it. He We're just, heading to overtime. He just shot him through default, Harry. Zantares jiggled and an awful way to lose the round and go to OT. That's got to feel rough. And look at these shots from Zantares. Smuya, he plays that round excellently. The second he realizes... Identity crisis. He's joined the enemy. He's running with wolves. The lost boy, Config. Oh, no! 
Ooh, that's not ideal. That's not great. He's in the market, though, and that's a lot of pressure for Big to try and handle. Sandares will catch him moving around. Oh, and no. this attempted B split has been severed in two. Zantares, unstoppable. <laughs> I'm... That is clock and as you say it is just the bait tizian's not even the starter they're gonna get their just desserts because they've made a meal out of this b play and nexus shut it all down quez alone and so much to do so much falling on the shoulders of the new boy on the block it's not even fair round goes the way of big flawless in overtime they're making a statement here eight rounds in a row well i certainly wouldn't one round is all it takes. Santares, he's even kicked it off, killing the AWP in window. Mad advantage here for Big. That bomb's still outside of the B site. Tizian just trying Big, remember that. It's been a while. Tessez getting the first. Tizian's going to move through to his death. Taps him with a molly at the back of the site. Will force Tessez out of position, but it's not going to force him in. And now the B play looking to come through. Tabs a <gasps> phenomenal shot. He's barely even touched the ground when he gets it. And now Zantara is arriving from the short flank. That might oh. be enough, and it probably is doubling down. It's Quez left up standing again, and he'll get put in the grave. Big, they've done it. They get the nine rounds in a row, not just to take it to overtime, but to close it out flawlessly in OT. And for Optic, they have...